this episode to this interview this woman is amazing she's a motivational speaker she's a successful entrepreneur she's doing events to inspire around the united states and around the world just to have that power to give back it's amazing to have met this beautiful person you will see right now please watch this amazing interview melissa and we love you Get your sexy on, don't be shy, girl, take it off. My name is Melissa Waterman. I am an entrepreneur, motivational speaker, philanthropist, uh, fitness competitor, and author, and I love life. And it wasn't always like this for me. So just to tell you a bit about myself, I was a foster child. My biological parents were heroin addicts. I didn't have it that easy when I was younger. Been on my own from the, from the age of 15 and I have had a very interesting journey. Started my first company at the age of 24, ended up getting married very young, and uh, five years ago ended up uh, losing uh, my marriage and also a couple of businesses that I had built. I found myself in a really dark place <coughs> and I wasn't gonna allow that to defeat me. I remember looking at myself in the mirror and I told myself, this adversity is not gonna define you. What are you gonna do to overcome all of these obstacles that have presented themselves in your life. So I decided five years ago to dig deep into personal development and it changed my life. Wait a second, why should you care what they think of you when you're all alone by yourself? Do you um, I consider a role model like a hero and to be quite honest to you, I am my own hero. I'm always in pursuit of excellence, in pursuit of happiness and pursuit of joy and I always want to be a better version of, of myself than I was yesterday you know I've, I've overcome a, a lot of a lot of things that I don't think most people would have I've been homeless I lived out of my car you know and and um, I inspire myself you know I inspire myself to just become better and and help people become better themselves through the adversities that they have faced you don't have to change a single thing you don't have to try 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 wow um for me that's my purpose and passion in life you know i'm i'm on a journey to help women rediscover themselves help them realize how amazing and significant they are and i also want to help them find their purpose and passion so that they can step into their greatness that is why I'm here and that's why I truly believe that God put me here on this earth. You don't have to try. For me it's important because I found myself in, in a lot of dark places and at that time I didn't have anyone to turn to and I felt lost. So I think it's important for me to be that vessel of hope and joy and help women along the way that have gone through difficult times. You know, I've experienced a divorce. Like I said, I've been homeless. I come from the foster care system. You know, I've been able to build a successful business. So I, I know I have the tools to be able to help those women that are looking to step into a better version of themselves. Try, 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 try. Uh, uh, you don't have to try. You don't have to try. Is believe in yourself. You know, there were so many times where I questioned myself and I doubted myself and, and, and it took me a while to take that leap of faith and the entire time I had everything here. You know, believe in yourself. God doesn't give you a vision that you can't execute. So whatever dream you have, plant that seed and make it happen. And if I can do it, you can do it too. I hope this message empowers you and I hope this helps someone out there today and God bless you. I'll see you later. If you'd like to find me, Melitza Wagi on Instagram. M-E-L-I-T-S-A W-A-A-G-E and I look forward to your messages. I'm here for you. Bye. Sun, curl your hair, run the extra mile, keep it slim so they like you. Do they like you?